Good day, everybody. <laughs> so anyways, so I woke up this morning at 2.40 because I went to bed last night at like 7.20. Felt like right asleep. I go to bed really early, like 7.20, 7.30. So yeah, so I woke up at 2.40. And I was like, oh man, it feels like I've been sleeping forever. It's gonna be super early in the morning. So I checked my uh, my clock and it was like 2.40. So I was like, sweet, let's do this. As soon as I woke up, I had this amazing idea. Like sick, sick idea. So I started writing it down. And then I started writing something else. Um, and uh, uh, it's not just my niece that's battling with this uh, this like internet addiction. I want to, I'll just call it an addiction. Um, my nephew's not too caught up in it. He's like 15. He's not too caught up. But my niece is kind of, she's caught up in the whole internet thing. And a lot of other kids are, you know. Um, and I was thinking about, you know, not just, this isn't about my niece, but this is pretty much just about overall society. And I was thinking, like, why are people so into this whole internet thing? And I wrote. And I don't know if I could get it from word for word. I'll just, um, I'll just kind of try to freelance. Okay, so pretty much the main reason I, I, I feel that we're becoming so addicted to uh, technological devices, even like Netflix and shows and movies and video games and laptops and cell phones and social media, Instagram, Twitter, stuff like that, is because the first thing is our society is so busy, you know, we're always like rushing around, we're always doing things, we're always trying to make money to pay for things because we've, um, you know, we've desired and we've feared so many things in our life or we've been told that we need to get things, and buy things and be certain people and be this and be that, that we, um, that we took on a lot. And even me, you know, I mean, like I was, you know, pushed to college from a very young age and, you know, I was told that I had to be something. So I went through that whole process and I became a teacher. I got a master's degree, went to grad school. Super, super in debt. I think it was like 70, I think it was like $72,000 in student loans, um, car payments, insurance for the car, for the Jeep that I owned, um, the house that I had, the, the apartment that I had to pay for my first year of teaching. I mean, it was, uh, dude, I was so unhappy. My God, I was so unhappy. It was like a nightmare. When I look back at the age of 25, it was a nightmare. And most of the people in our society are living in that nightmare, you know. Um, they have like these unfulfilling lives. So how do they escape that nightmare? You know, well, some people use relationships. Some people, uh, you know, drift towards drinking and drugs and eating. Um, and, you know, drinking, you know, caffeinated beverages and um you know, using whatever form of escapism as possible. And the newest form of escapism is Netflix, TV shows, uh, movies, Hulu, um, Amazon Prime, buying things, buying materialistic possessions, um, uh, going on social media, becoming obsessed with Instagram and Twitter and, and Facebook and what other people are doing. Um, you 
and it's it's just it's 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 just become the norm. It's become normal to do such things, you know, and, and we don't even question like, am I supposed to be doing this? Is this making me happy? Is this actually healthy? We're just doing it. No question. And society's pushing it, you know, society is, you know, put, you know, keeping it in motion because they're saying like, oh, this is totally normal. Um, And I think one of the major reasons for it is that since we are in this state of rushing around to, uh, to take on all these things that we've taken on because of the desires and the fears and uh, you know what we were told we had to be, what we had to do, what we still have to do, what we were told what we need to take on to be happy, how to be happy. So in order to pay for all these things, in order to achieve all these things, we, most of us work on fulfilling jobs. Uh, we have to rush around constantly to, uh, to, meet these deadlines or to take care of other people, take care of our children, whatever the case may be. And we're rushing around and we're rushing around and we're rushing around and we're doing and we're doing and we're doing and we're not stopping. There's no stop. There's not enough hours in the day. And we're very spread out too. We don't even know most of our neighbors. Okay, I gotta go. All right, peace. Have fun, guys. Later. I'll talk about this later on.